stay watchful. Spectres are still drawn to you. Oh, brilliant. You chose the schoolhouse too. Of course. Our last night together. I knew it. And now the question is, how do we reach it? I like your doll. What are you doing? This is Aleja. She is a witch, and she is running away from the Spanish soldiers. She had a horse, but he died. He was an old friend. Maybe we can build her a raft. I'm Antia. What's your name? To hell with that. Was that an echo? In the void? I don't know, and I don't want to know. Patience, Aunt Taya. You know that we have to be twice as good as them to get half of what they have. Ugh. I can't stand anymore. Huh? That's unfit for us to cross. I know. <laughs> I think your mother is jealous of you. I'm better than she was a mite. Of course she is. We could train in secret. Practice when she's not looking. These are memories from my childhood. Why here? Have another in sight. Help if you need it.
over there, a passageway. The paths form and reform. Your passageway's already gone. This place has a plan for us, and I suspect we may not like it. It's just us here and there. Damn it! The void centers in on us. Perhaps you've been thinking about your past and memories are manifesting. Or the other way around. Tell me. Calendre is here. Your childhood friend is here. What passed for my friend? Right. We leave now. You explain later. her without knowing how. Back then I didn't know what she was. She's... Free yourself, Andrea. Let the fire match your shackles. Careful, Red. It's close.
led by the nose. It's playing with us. Wants us to feel powerless. <laughs> I'll feast on your soul. You're one once. Never again. Never again. Come and play, Andrea. Come and play. You will never leave this place. You can go around the fire. You must go through. Go to hell. Look at you now. Look at you dead. Clinging to some pitiful soul in a hopeless search for meaning. Thank you, Rory McVeigh, for bringing her to me. This thing was never human, Red. Don't indulge it. You'll soon be mine. Your voice, your soul, everything. Damn you. You want to play, Calendre? Fine. Let's play. At last you visit Calendre, your bestest friend. We are not friends, and your name is not Calendre. <laughs> Perhaps I should name myself by what called me to you. Your weariness? Your solitude? <laughs> your arrogance? I have just one question. Why me? I heard your call. You are such a powerful soul. How could I not answer? How could I not come and play? The shining craving in your heart led the way. All I had to do was follow. All I had to do was take you. I was a child. If I had power, it was raw and uncontrolled. And deliciously rare. Pure and perfect. Wrapped in the imperfect mind of this imperfect girl. But now you're here? Now I can finally have you. What are you, exactly? What are you doing here in the void? Ask her. Ask Andrea. The only one who ever cares for you, or ever will. Because she sent me here. Because she banished me. Tell me, Rory of the Clan McGraith, when you realize you hardly know the woman you love, how does it feel to learn after all these years together these things she never deigned to tell you? These things that sit brooding at the very center of her soul. My love for her is unconditional. But is hers? Why do you lead us here? What do you want from us? Don't humor it, Rory. Careful now. 
the idea of tearing your precious little pet into pieces just became much more appealing. I'd hate for you to get hurt so fast while you try to save him. But, oh wait, you already did that, didn't you? Rory, please. For years, I would not shoulder the weight of what I did. I would not face my regrets. I would not wear my guilt. My home burned to the ground. My face was marked forever. When I look in the mirror, I think of you. I fled the family I'd nearly killed. I buried my true feelings in hate for you. No more. I loved you once. You were my sister. You were my soul. I don't care what you really are. To me, you are manipulation and lies and nothing else. If the void birthed you, then I pity you. I forgive Calendre for being nothing but a mirror. And I forgive myself for not knowing better. And you, Rory McGrath? Can you forgive her? for leaving you alone and unloved and haunted only by her memory. The souls we banish end up in the void. I know this now. I pity them. I pity you. Your pity means nothing to me, mortal. You are nothing. How convenient, then, that I don't need you to give myself closure. Mantea, Mantea. Such a clever girl. So good with words of power. Is that how you seduced your little pet here? And I am the relentless servant of the Queen of Kerr. The hell? Come, stay a while, stay forever. This on for size.
This is my realm! on for sap. My my rules. I will reap your soul. Cheating. This is my realm. As stubborn as you are, you've not changed. My domain, my rules. I'm stronger and faster. I'll destroy you. Ah! <laughs> 
Hugging all the fun. something. I never told you the full story. I'm sorry. No need. Please, let's get out of here. <laughs> 